of awesome stuff today at uh, a couple of rummage sales and yesterday I went to the thrift store so I'm just going to share it all at once. Um, so the first rummage sale that we went to, this lady, I think it was for her grandson um, that she had all of these things. Anyway, uh, she had a lot of stuff from like 3T to 6 or 7 and um, it was all marked 75 cents but then when I took everything up to her she said I don't really want to add 75 cents that many times so we're just going to make it 50 cents and I was like okay I will take that. So the first thing is this pair of jeans which she did already have 50 cents on these um, but especially for being for a boy um, I mean like the knees aren't even worn that much and nothing dragged on the ground they're like pretty perfect so um these are size five so he's got a while oh my gosh I didn't even realize it had a skull in the back pocket you don't even know how happy I am right now and that's all it takes um my son got well at my baby shower we got a uh, homemade like hooded towel and it's got like I don't know circus animals or something but at least it's big enough and you know we don't have to worry about it whatever circuses just aren't my thing I don't like circus animals it's not my theme whatever anyway um, I did find another little homemade one that's like um, a hard hat and then this is like a really nice plush towel too and then it has some tools so um so you can use this one and then um the other one is just a little bit smaller that we have so that can be for the new baby once it's time um yeah all of these were marked 75 cents so they were only 50 but um i don't even think these are worn like they're still like kind of stiff from the store you know um, Oshkosh Bagosh, size 3T. Here's another pair, and actually he has a pair on right now because the cloth diaper I had on him, uh, leaked a little bit. So, um, these are 3T. They're not as stiff as the other ones, but they're, like, they look brand new. That's also why I'm thinking she must have been a grandma. Because he did not get much wear out of these clothes. This also had 75 cents on. Um, I think these, yeah, five. But they're Carters. I mean, like, they're really soft. I don't even think these are washed, actually. Maybe once. They're not pilly on the inside at all or anything, and they're super soft. So cute. Oh, he also has a Bob the Builder tank top on right now that he got from there. Um, I mean, he doesn't really have many 3T tank tops yet, so I don't know that his mom rocks, but we got that. In total, from this rummage sale, I got three full, uh, like, grocery bags of stuff, and I think I paid seven fifty. <laughs> so definitely worth my while to stop there. Again, this was marked 75 cents, and she gave it to me for 50 cents. And yeah, gosh, gosh, size 5. But it's a really nice fleece sweatshirt. Not really nice for days like this, but, uh, you know, later. Okay, and then these say dude on them. I just really like them. There was a sweatshirt that was supposed to go with them, but it was kind of ugly. So, I just got the pants. Okay. Oh, I forgot I even picked this one up. I was gonna put it back. My husband will know exactly why I got this. He calls me chief and I hate it and now he started calling Sawyer chief so I just got that because for 50 cents it's a tank top and who cares I guess. Um, this set of pajamas was also 50 cents. Shorts and a little t-shirt. And I don't even know what size this is. 4T, but I'm pretty sure he could probably even wear it now. Um, 
Okay. Got this. 50 cents. He likes sharks lately. Uh, this is really cute. I'm pretty sure. Oh, no. There are a few stains on the back of it, so I guess I don't have to care about him getting it messy. 50 cents. And then this last pair of sweatpants that I got for 50 cents. Um, they are, I think also, yeah, 5T. And they have little cargo. I'm just really happy that I got all that stuff. And then, okay, so that was the three bags from that one. We stopped at another one because they had baby hangers advertised. She had five of them taped together and a dollar marked on that. And I'm pretty sure you can get like the 10 pack at Walmart for 98 cents. So I did not end up getting those. But anyway, um, I got these little <laughs> size 10. Um, I would call them rain boots, but he's going to wear these in the barn. So um, poop boots probably is what we're going to end up calling them. But they're really super nice. I don't even think anybody wore them actually. So that's great. Those are size 10. He's got a while. And then we stopped at another one. Um, got this. He really, he's good in the bathtub. He blows bubbles. He's not afraid of water at all, which might be a bad thing. Um, we went to the lake the other day and he ran right into the water. So that makes me a little nervous. And I think if I put one of these on him, it might help a little bit. And it was only 50 cents. So... I was pretty excited to find this. Um, got some maternity stuff for myself. Actually, this is more like postpartum stuff, but um, these pants and this like little over, I don't know, there's silky stuff on it and it's gonna make me feel good when I'm not feeling real great about how I look. Um, those were 50 cents a piece. I just like using these to sleep. Um, and then, I don't know if these are going to fit because they're mediums and my chest gets awfully large after I have a child, but we'll see. For 50 cents, it's not like I'm out a whole lot. And these are usually like 20 bucks, so it's going to be worth it just to check it out. And then these were a dollar a piece. Normally, I don't know if I'd pay that, but... We, the ones that we have now are just the ones that cling right to the window and they don't always cling and they get air in them and they flap around and whatever. So I figured for a dollar a piece, we'll just use these window shades and, oh, I didn't even realize there's Mater. I don't know what the other one is. Maybe I broke it. Maybe I should have checked that at the rummage sale. Well, you just have to know how to use it. Okay. Um, and then at this same rummage sale, I got two pairs of Nike shoes. I'm normally not, oh, these still have sand in them. Great. Um, they were 50 cents a piece. I'm normally not like all about him sharing shoes and whatever because I don't know, I think it's just not that great for his feet or whatever, but these are just for like bobbing around outside in, and so for 50 cents, I mean, they're pretty good condition. A little dirty on the bottom, didn't look at that, but who cares for two quarters, I mean, I think that's worth it. And then, this is the last bag from that rummage sale, where my stepdad, actually we picked him up to take uh, him with us to the last rummage sale because I knew it was going to be stuff that I wanted to look at and um, all of the ones that we go to we're going because there are you know kids clothes but that means there are kids toys there as well and he thinks that he needs to sit on everything that has a seat and he does not like to get off so we took my stepdad along and he was very helpful in that so he got himself a picnic table and a car and <laughs> I think that might have been it that way and then some clothes but um all of these all of the clothes she had there were 50 cents a piece or if you got three then it was a dollar so I did not spend very much at this one but that's cute that's a 3t these are 3t 
so cute. Um, a 3T sweater. Okay. Somebody's up from his nap. Yes, those are shoes. Um, these are the shorts that he already had on. And here's that Bob the Builder tank top, which um, it says 5T inside there, but he's only wearing 2T and it was not that big on him. So I'm glad I tried that on first. And then, um, this was another one for the three for a dollar things. Uh, these are all bigger sizes for like next year, except for this, which has motorcycles and skulls on it. Perfect. Yes. World's best brother. Um, he does have one like this. I think it's like Best Brother in the Galaxy or something like that. And it glows in the dark from Children's Place. But that's a... I want to say that might be a 3T and this is a 2T. So either way, he's going to be a new brother. So he can wear a lot of those shirts. Thank you. And then I got him this pajama set. Mostly because uh, these colors are awesome. Because it's already a 2T and pajamas are only kind of small, so I don't know if that's even going to fit him, but I just think it's adorable. And then, when we went to the thrift store yesterday, we got, yeah, thank you, stickers. Um, yesterday, we went to the thrift store, I got, um, this bag was full, and uh, it was half off, so 50 cents. I'm trying to sort them all out on my kitchen table right now. It's not working that great. Um, but there are flashcards for learning letters, um, capitals and lowercase. There are, um, I don't know what this is going to do, just to do a puzzle and then see what order the letters go in. I don't know. And then numbers. Um, there are two sets of flashcards for learning numbers. One of them is like the actual digits and then spelling them out. So I think we did okay for 50 cents for that many. Yeah. Um, and then I got him this little doctor kit. That was $1.25. It has a stethoscope. I don't know. Like usually I think these are probably 10 bucks or something now at the store. And this looks pretty nice. So the syringe. Um, thermometer tweezers and then oh this one does work it lights up it's hard to see on there but it does and then this one's supposed to light up because it has that same button but it doesn't but either way um i think that was all pretty good stuff and then the last thing i think i got from the thrift store is this because it was 80 cents and we used to have this in my classroom when i was in like second grade and i loved them so, um, check it out. I don't know if this brings back memories for anybody else looking at these pages. But then when I looked at the guide in the back last night, I was like pretty excited. Because, um, but I did try it actually last night and I can't see anything anymore. Like, even if I cross my eyes and pull it away, whatever. So we're going to have to practice with that. But I was excited to find it. <gasps> That's a stethoscope. Here you go. Okay. So, anyways, that's everything from the rummage sale in the thrift store for this week, probably. Tomorrow morning, Saturday. And even though there are a lot of sales that I probably would go to, we're going to breakfast on the farm. That's what happens when you live in Wisconsin. And uh, then we're having a cookout with some of our friends for lunch here. So, on our farm. So, um, we're probably not going to have time for rummage sale tomorrow. And that's okay because I found all this stuff. And um, I had a 20 on me. <laughs> and all this uh, was $18, I think, that I spent. So, we're doing okay. But $2 isn't going to get us much anywhere else. So. Thank you for watching.